What's good, everybody? Hope everybody's having a beautiful day. Spreading love, loving yourself, and being the best version of yourself, my baby. What are you talking about? Look, man, the sun, the sun down and everything. I've been outside taking care of myself, catching vibes, raising the freaking frequency and everything. But look, I want to talk to something because look, now in rap music, I'm sure y'all know because this is all they talk about. All they talk about is drugs, having sex, and killing people, bro. Like that's all they talk about now. And I, I wanted to. I wanted to come and talk to y'all about that because the rappers influence the youth. The youth like the youth like to listen to music and shit, music that they can bump to and everything. But they nobody makes music that can up like uplift people like that. Like there is music, but there's always something that goes along with it. Like you get what I'm saying, bro. There's always, always something that goes along with it that tells you to do something out of your way that will bring you down or something that can mess up your life like a lot of these rappers are soulless soulless and that's an that's what i wanted to talk about mainly is how rappers are soulless some rappers are not all most of them are soulless bro like peep game peep game i don't completely know because i don't just research the mans but Pretty sure NBA young boy is soulless, bro. But look, and this goes to show that money, materialistic things, and all this other shit, drugs, uh, you know what I'm saying, cars, anything, bro, will not buy you happiness. It will only bring you temporary happiness. Cause look, every time you see this man, he he never looks happy, bro. You see him smiling in his music videos when he's got his his guns and shit, when he's smoking a blunt, bro. What if he had none of that, bro? All you see is him like. And then, I'm not disrespecting nobody. I'm not disrespecting nobody. I'm telling you how it is. Rappers sell their soul. The most valuable thing you have, your soul, within everything. The way you feel, the way you do things with your life, how you do things, uh, anything. Just who you are in person, who you are, how people know you because you give off this certain vibe. Your love, energy, the way you feel, everything. That's your soul, bro. That's your soul, right? They will sell that for money, for it to have hella hoes, for materialistic shit, for cars, for everything, bro. All that bullshit that you don't need that will just not bring you... It will not bring you happiness at all. It will, like I said, it will bring you temporary happiness. All that bullshit just so they... They will sell their most valuable thing just so they can have that shit. When in reality, I'm going to tell y'all straight like it is. When in reality, if you put in the work with your life, right? If you put in the work with your life, go hard enough, manifest, believe in yourself, have faith, patience. You will get all that. Get all that. A lot of people don't want to go that extra mile. A lot of people don't want to. Like I said, I'm not disrespecting nobody. I'm telling you what you need to hear, how it is, for real. A lot of people don't want to go that extra mile. A lot of people don't want to go harder, bro. Some, bro. some people don't have patience. They want it now. Some people don't have faith in themselves. Some people don't believe. They don't think they have the power within them to do it. They don't believe, and that's why they be in such a sad state of mind. And when they sell their soul, you have, no, you have no remorse. You have no feeling for anything, bro. You have no feeling for anything. That's why some rappers who actually kill, they kill because they don't feel they don't feel they can't feel because their most valuable thing is gone like for example juice world literally posted before he passed he literally posted that he was selling his soul and when he said he was selling his soul he said man i'm gonna be rich as hell y'all i'm selling my soul i'm gonna be rich as hell he did it for the money money will not bring you happiness bro and look all he talked about was depression, sad songs, and all that. He had a few, you know what I'm saying, like hype songs or whatever. But all he talked about was sadness, getting his heart broken, depression, this, that, drugs. Talking about, uh, I'm going to drink my pain. All this other stuff, bro. Like, I'm I'm telling y'all, when, you, when you sell your soul, you have nothing left, bro. You have nothing left. You think this money is everything. You think 
having more cars than everybody is everything. You think flexing your jewelry, looking, you trying to, you trying to look more rich than billionaires. Like, why do billionaires wear regular clothes? Cause money doesn't buy you happiness. It will not. Some people, bruh, money should never change you. Why? Cause it's, it's, it's material shit. It, dude, money shouldn't change you. Like if, bruh. This shit is, it's sad to see somebody give away their soul, like, on some real shit. Because, look, I would never, bro, that thought has never even come to my mind. For money, I can manifest that into my life. For happiness, I'm naturally a happy, peaceful person. Somebody just war in, won in war zone. Where's that? Somebody just won in war zone. But, look, hold on, let me let him pass me, because I'm trying to talk to you. Um, oh, now. Better stop coming by me like that. Oh no. But look. Look. People sell their soul for some things that they can obtain if you work hard enough and you focus on yourself. Happiness, you can achieve that by focusing on yourself. Money, you can manifest that into your life by doing what you love. Fucking a house, materialist cars, bro. You can manifest all that into your life, like I said, but materialistic shit will not bring you happiness. Some people let the money change them. They let that shit control them. They think it makes them better than the next person, which it doesn't. It doesn't. If you think that, psh, please, bro, like, come on now. What if money was no thing? What would you do with your life? I'd be doing what I'm doing right now. Because you know why? Because I fucking love what I do, bro. I love what I do. And I know I'm manifesting everything into my life because we all have the same power within us. I'm not saying that just like I'm the only one that can do that. Everybody can do that. Everybody has the power to manifest. Everybody has the power, to, has it within them to be happy. Everything is within you. Everything is within you. You just got to focus on yourself enough to realize that and stop giving away. Stop giving. Dude, stop breaking off family for money. Stop. Don't ever sell your soul. You will, ha you will feel nothing no more. Nothing will... Nothing will affect you like how it does. Like, you know, like if something happens, like say you achieve something, you you uh, achieve a goal or something like that. And you are like, yeah, yeah, you proud of yourself. You're like, man, I could, if I could do this, I could do something else. I just got to put in that work. But say you sold your soul and you achieve something, you're going to be like, you know, like, come on, bro. Nothing will ever be the same. And this is why you should never sell your soul. All rappers, bro, rappers do it for money, like I said, materialistic shit, and to have the most bitches, bro. They're not bitches. That's just what they say in all their songs. They're not bitches. They're beautiful women. But look, and that's all they talk about. Y'all don't see it. Like my boy Annalie Chopper. This is why, this is why I love Chop, bro, because he speaks about the real shit, how you can get everything from within. Of course, he still got his drill songs, all this, all this, whatever. But, bro, Man sees the shit for what it is. That, and that's what I want people to start doing, bro. Like, if so, if people took a break from listening to all this drill, because all this drill music and all this killing music, everything is brainwashing you to think. They're brainwashing you. That's how the Matrix works. They're brainwashing you to think that's the path that you need to take to be hard, to look hard for other people. All they want is for you to care about what other people think, have fear, uh, feel like you need money to be happy and need all this shit that's just gonna break you it will all break you running through a hundred hoes is gonna do nothing for you but give all these thotties your energy give all these thotties your most valuable energy your sexual energy money doesn't buy you happiness like i'm repeating myself because i want to get this through yo like i want y'all to know this shit bro and then look when you sell your soul what, when you sell your soul, and then they they got they got control of you no matter what you do. They can take control of your mind at an instant. They can make you do something that you would never do if you had a soul. Bro, like, they say, bro, you see what happened, bro. Look, you see what happened in Juice World, right? He sold his soul. Real shit, you can look it up. You can look it up. A video will pop right up. He sold his soul, right? And then when they they said it was his time to go, it was his calling, he was gone, bro. He was gone. He was gone. And they, like, I heard so much different shit about how it happened, that he took pills, 
that he was uh, spewing up blood and shit from his mouth. But the devil called him, bro. The Illuminati, whatever it is, they called him. It was his time. And that's because they had this. They had within what was within him. That, and that's everything. And that's why, bro. Listen, listen to me real quick. One more thing. Nothing, nothing, there's nothing that you can't do. There's nothing that you can't do. You have to, you have to have patience. You have to have faith in yourself. No, you can do it. 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 Start writing it down. Tell yourself this every day. Say affirmations about what you want, and it will start to manifest into your life if you want it to. Not if you just do it once, and then you're like, oh, man. You know what I'm saying? I did it, but it didn't. You got that. That's where the faith and patience comes in. You got to be patient for this. Your time will come. Your time will come. You have a purpose. If you follow that, you'll be blessed with an abundance of everything. An abundance of everything that brings you real love and happiness to your life. And you got to understand that. Have faith. Be patient. Believe in yourself and know you can do it. Don't never be on no. Don't never. Don't ever bring yourself down or let somebody around you bring you down or think you need something outside of yourself to be happy because look it'll never work it'll never work you'll stay stuck you you'll bring yourself down more and that's why you should stop listening to these rappers talking about this is this is what you need to do to be hard oh this is some g shit this is the street code bro man fuck all that shit bro go, go home and focus on yourself can you do that can you do that? Can you stay in a room by yourself all day with no device, with no TV? If you can't do that, you need to focus on yourself. Take the time to focus on yourself and stop being distracted. Rappers who say they so, anybody that said they so, you can't feel anymore. You can't feel anymore. And you are, they are in control of you. They are in control of you, the demons. So watch that shit and stop listening to everything that these rappers, these real real g's what whatever y'all want to call them bro with these whatever you want to call them bro these uh uh shot callers top shotters whatever you want to call them bro stop listening to them and listen to yourself listen to that voice you don't need anything you don't need money to be happy you don't need materialistic shit you don't need a person a certain person to be happy it, everything you need is within yourself and i mean that I mean that. Watch this shit for what it is. Watch this shit for what it is. I love y'all so much. I hope y'all have a beautiful day. I wanted to talk about this because I was listening to a song. And it was young boy. And he was like, shorty playing games. She don't want to sell her soul, man. That makes me think he sold his soul. And he wants the women that are coming to his life to be just like him. That's why. That's probably why he don't feel. That's probably why he don't feel. That's probably why he's always like, he never looks happy, but he has everything that goes to show you. I love you all. I hope you had the most beautiful day. Continue to be the best version of yourself at all times and never give up on yourself. More of the story. That's what I came here to tell you. Never give up on yourself. Believe in yourself. Have faith in yourself because your time will come. I promise. I love you all. Have a beautiful day.